Thank you, Dana. Today in Tennessee, hundreds of people gathered at the state capitol demanding change after the Covenant School shooting in Nashville. Reporter Marissa Sulik was at the rally and spoke to one man whose dad played a key part in helping police get to the shooter inside the school. As hundreds of people walked up the state capitol steps, they all had their signs, their reasons for gun control. But one man stayed hours after because he had an extra reason. My father is the school pastor there. Jack Sullivan's dad, Matthew Sullivan, works at the Covenant School. He was there when the shooting happened Monday. He heard the fire alarms and didn't know what, that, what was going on, and so he went outside per fire drill. Matthew Sullivan was one of the few people outside when Metro Police officers arrived at the school. In fact, he's the man you see next to the door in this body camera video. He gives his keys to Officer Rex Engelbert, allowing him to get in the building and get to the shooter. I just started crying when I saw it, yeah. Just thinking about what he was experiencing. I'm a, I'm a teacher myself, I was in school, and my phone started blowing up um, that there was a shooter at my dad's school. And I was just terrified, all the thoughts running through my head. While his dad is safe, Jack, as a teacher himself, fears for the safety of his students and kids across America, which is why he's still on this bench hours later. I think lawmakers need to face the fact that what happened is um, just such a tragedy and it's so preventable to take the weapons that were used, AR-15 assault weapons, out of the hands of people who want to do things like this. Jack said his dad is still very much in shock, and because he's a spiritual leader, he's doing what he can to minister to families.